Always tracking, first to alert. Oh, welcome back and hoping you all enjoyed your afternoon hours. Our temperatures right where they needed to be. Here's a look at the highs we've seen so far today. Not officially, but 77 here in El Paso. So on average, we should be in the upper 70s. So we were right there. Las Cruces a few degrees above average with temperatures in the high so far of 82. Mid 70s for Alamogordo. Cloud cropped in the lower 70s with some 60s on the map. Guadalupe Pass and Ridoso mid 50s. The high so far today. Temperatures outside right now still pretty comfortable. We're looking at 77 currently here in the El Paso area with our winds at 14 mile per hour. Winds are at 13 miles per hour. Las Cruces with temperatures still in those lower 80s. 82 is the current temperature if you plan on stepping outdoors. For tonight, mostly clear skies, 55 the expected overnight low. Lower 50s for the Las Cruces area, but overall a pleasant night. Now for tomorrow, we're going to continue to track those windy or those low end windy conditions, breezy conditions by your afternoon hours. Your Wednesday planner shows we're going to wake up with 50 degree temperatures, quickly warm up to the mid 70s by lunchtime, and then lower 80s are expected by your three o'clock hour. 84 is the expected high with breezy conditions expected. Just a few clouds for the Las Cruces area tomorrow and 81 the expected high for tomorrow. So we're going to continue to track those winds, as I mentioned, breezy, upper end breezy, low end windy, but those wind gusts will increase Thursday into your Friday with 40 mile per hour wind gusts expected. Now for the next three days, we do have the green light at least on Wednesday and Thursday, but you notice I put the yellow light on Friday. That's because storm chances are back in the forecast for the weekend. So you might wash your car, then get mad at me because it's going to get dirty for Saturday, Sunday, Monday into your Tuesday. Sunday and Monday, it looks as if it's our greatest chance to see some storms right now at a 30% chance. On top of that, that cold front that's bringing that moisture with it is also going to drop down our afternoon highs. We're going from 80s to 70s to the return of 60 degree temperatures Sunday into Monday of next week. Don't forget, you can download the ABC 7 Storm Track Weather and Traffic app to stay up to date on all these changes in the forecast. But seven day forecast sponsored by Mattress Firm shows 80s. Then we see those changes by Saturday into Sunday with 60s sticking around for Monday of next week. More news after the break. Don't go anywhere.